On the outskirts of Abu Dhabi is a 45 minute drive that is called Al Wathba. <laughs> Al Wathba is full of amazing natural scenery. In this video, I will show you the six gratifying things to do around Al Wathba Desert. How sweet it is to be loved. Thank you for choosing to watch this video. If you do enjoy it, I would really appreciate if you could give me a like. That would really help my channel. Thank you so much. Al Wathba Fasil Dunes. A visit to these bizarre structures is a mandatory activity in the list of things to do in Al Wathba. According to the experts, the unique shape of the dunes and rocks were created by a mix of wind, sand, and time, drenched with calcium carbonate to create nature's own eccentric sculptures. Anyone who visits this place will feel like they land on another planet. This is the Salt Lake in Abu Dhabi, a new viral destination in Al Wathba. The narrow pastel green lake filled with mushroom-like stacks of sodium chloride generally takes an extensive period of time to form naturally. According to the experts, the high concentration of salt makes the water very dense, therefore, Anyone can easily float because of the natural buoyancy. And the unique salt formation are stable enough for visitors to hop on and achieve that whimsical snap for the gram. Sheikh Zayed Festival is a global cultural commemoration held annually to complement with National Day celebrations. This is the largest family event take place in Abu Dhabi every year with lots of surprises and new attractions. You'll be able to see the grand pavilions and exhibitions of UAE heritage that highlight the history and union of the UAE, as well as the Union March and various aspects of UAE culture. night, you will get the chance to experience the wonderful fireworks displays 
and the Emirates Fountain, which uses the most advanced technology. Pathways. Okay. Okay, the first one is the spiny kid lizard, which is around uh, one, one kilo and 700 meters. Uh huh. Uh, and the other one, which is the, the flamingo trait, which you experience watching the flamingo. Uh huh. Uh, but the twist is that you cannot see the flamingo face to face. Uh huh. You need to open a window and see it. Because window. Because of the corona. Oh, oh okay. okay. Uh, yeah, so first of all, you go from here, you go right, and then you. Al Wathba Wetland Reserve was established by Sheikh Zayed in 1998. In here, you will enjoy walking as you discover the changing ecosystem from scenic water pools to forest of tall grass, gravel plains, and more. You will also gain an insight into the migration patterns of the migratory birds and also learn about the various local flora and their uses. If you are lucky, you can witness more than 4,000 flamingos, the reserve's famous attraction. In this beautiful resort, you can experience an intimate hideaway within a desert landscape. Al Wathba Desert Resort, inspired by traditional houses, has 103 guest rooms and villas, features arabesque accessories. You'll be able to experience an exclusive natural environment with the space to reconnect and the freedom to lose yourself. This is the man-made lake in Al Wathba. During winter time, it is one of the favorite spots for barbecue and camping. Please do not expect too much from this place. There is no toilet around and it is just a man-made pond in the middle of nowhere. However, you get the chance to stay here overnight and have barbecue and enjoy the sunrise view the following day. And I guess that experience alone is awesome. Thank you for watching and don't forget, keep on exploring, keep on discovering and connect with the people around you. Much love, MG.